G'day, welcome back to Atlas, and it's time to take on the Hydra. Make sure that if you like the content, you go ahead and hit that like button, because it really helps out the channel. Uh, YouTube really likes it when people like the videos and comment on them, it'd be good to hear from you. So, we're going to kill this thing. Uh, I'm basically just using my carbine with the, the lucky loader feet, and we're going to go with it from there. And another thing I guess that uh, I haven't really brought up in too many videos is I have a Discord server these days. Uh, it's been set up quite nice and neat. It'd be good if um, people could come in there. If you've got any questions on Atlas, on Ark, or any other games that we uh, play, feel free to drop in and uh, have a chat. At, at any rate, with the uh, Hydra, I'm just going to keep plugging away at it here. Um, it's not a particularly interesting fight with the recommended method. I mean, a lot of people come in here with bows and arrows, and they come here with thousands of arrows, and they just shoot it over time, and eventually you drop it one head at a time. In my case, I'm just going to use a carbine. I've got a backup carbine in my inventory, and we're just going to go from there. Well, enjoy, because uh, I'll cut it up just as so each head dies, uh, and that's pretty much about all I can really do with it, because there is nothing more to this fight than what you're seeing now. You just slowly, one head at a time, plug away at it. This is probably one of the fights that I wish that they uh, did a bit more with and found some more interesting mechanics and techniques that could be used against it. Uh, at least with the dragon, which I'm hoping to do next, you can basically kite it with a boat and shoot it with the balusters. But this one, not so much. Alright, well, enjoy. There you go. And one head down. There we go. Alright, that looks like second head down. And it's still stuck. Okay, that's probably another head down. The fact that it's stuck, it's actually going to be a problem. There's another head behind stuck in the wall there. I need to get to it. So we'll take down this last head, and then we're going to have to try and somehow get it out without it getting me. Alright, and here's the next part, I guess. Now, I do have a backup, but, you know, I'm killing the fourth head now out of five, and I broke my gun. So, if you're using carbines, obviously, decent carbines, you definitely want to bring two. Um, obviously, to be safe, you could build, bring three. I know a lot of people bring bows. Now, I don't really feel the need to kill one of the most powerful creatures in the game with a bow, but at the same time, this, uh, fight is quite gimmicky. It really, really is. Okay, the next one's down. And now what am I going to do? Might need to uh, climb down and see if it will move or not. All right, we're now on the rocks, just opposite. It's coming out. We we'll finally finish it off. Take out the last head. Done. Hide you down. I should actually have the uh, mythos. Or, yeah, two thousand mythos for that. Did I get my power stone as well? Do there's the artifact key. I've got two hours to get there now. Um, goodness, where am I? I gotta remember where it is now. All right, we're at the cave. I've got a few bears with me just as uh, protection because there are things in this cave which are going to hurt a lot. Let's get some out. Not coming out. Come on, bats, get out of the cave. I'll do. I'll kill it instead. Luckily, it looks like they can't actually get out of the cave. You can use the choke point to just prevent them from getting to you. Is 
have 250 down. Alright, next stage. It looks like there's a whole bunch more over here. So just gotta be a bit careful. I saw scorpions and a more and a snake, I thought. Yeah. Oh, I see you. Alright, what have we got? Bloody bats. There's ants over there. Those guys seem to be fighting each other, which is good. I don't mind. Alright, we're almost there. Whoa! No, 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 no. Just cleaned all that out. All right, they're being silly together. Run! Got it. Run! Oh wait, no, I'm trying to get these up. Alright, let's get out. Oh dear. Well, where yeah, there you have it. We're done. It was a bit of a rush at the end, even though I was trying to take it slow. Now, apparently I could make the creatures fight each other, and that just allowed me to sprint in and sprint out just to get myself done. Um, yes. Done. When we look at our inventory now, though, you should see a new dot on your compass there, and when you're looking at your map, you can have a look and see that there's a new little embedded gemstone or the power stone in your compass so now i've got to go to all the other islands and pick up all the other power stones and i guess next up i'm going to try and do the dragon i'm going to see if i can kill it with a boat rather than shooting it with a carbine and i do find that the uh, uh the hydra is not that interesting of a fight because the the standard method people use is this shooting method and it's not particularly interesting um, I would like to see some tactics that could be used. And so if you do know some other tactics to use other than drowning the Hydra, I'd like to know about it. Hey, let me know what you think. How do you go about doing these Power Stone Islands and how do you do about doing the caves? But, you know, it's done now. And on to the next one. Alright, well thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.